Hello there, everybody, Vespa here, and welcome back to the Escapist 2. Oh my god. Holy shit. It took forever to get any batteries whatsoever, but I now have six. I got five in my desk here, and I've got one beneath me on the floor. It took god damn forever. I am actually going to... G give me the chocolate. G g give me the chocolate. I wish that menu would go away faster than it actually does. It takes forever for that menu to actually go away. But oh my god. Oh, security level decreasing. Thank you. So now we have enough to actually go and do that thing that we want to do. And actually, um, what is it? It was the energy node. I needed two energy. I needed two power modules to get rid of that energy node. So let's go ahead. Uh, actually, let's start some desk here. I want to see if I can find a screwdriver. Oh, I know. God damn it. Maybe I won't be able to find a screwdriver. Anyway, let's go ahead and grab two of these uh we'll have to go to breakfast time first and i think from breakfast time i'll go over so uh it doesn't really matter if my desk gets searched per se i'm gonna stay at breakfast time until it switches and then we're gonna go and we're gonna try and see what this energy module module thing is all about holy shit but how you get batteries in this prison apparently you don't search any desks because i got no batteries for searching desks at all none zero zip nada i got them only from beating up guards which is fucking stupid man i, I got them for beating up guards like that's literally how um, i forget some of the crafting no that doesn't go in there that's literally how i got them i just beat up tons of guards like it's so stupid! Ah, it's not crafting. Nah, it's not crafting. Like, that's how you get batteries in this prison. You just beat up the guards, and that's the easiest way to get batteries. That's probably the only way, actually, to get batteries, in all honesty. Uh... I don't really need shovels at all in this prison. I... Well, let's go around. I really don't. There's no point in having shovels at all. So... We're gonna go up, and we're gonna see what is behind this thing, since I've got two power nodes now. I've got a contraband detector so I don't get caught with my contraband. And I've got a red key to let me in. What comes next? Free time. Okay. That is perfect. Is there any guards up there? There's one guard for sure up here. So let's try and avoid his gaze, because I still don't know if they... do anything to you if they notice that you're in here. So... Maybe crafting two energy nodules. There's one... And there's two. Okay, now I'm in. So, let's see what's in this desk. Get bloody jetpack! Oh, shit, tits, dude. It's not contraband? Why is that not contraband? I want to see what's up in this desk. I need a screwdriver as well, because I want to show you guys something that I figured out while editing the last episode. Where's this guy going? I'm not getting caught by you. It's not gonna happen. I don't want to get caught. Ah, uh, shit. What goes after free time? Frog, I'm going to get caught. You guys don't care that I'm back here. What? They didn't care that I was back there. At all. Ooh. Ooh. I thought I was going to lose my pouch there for a second. Let's go ahead put those away. We got drop this token powder. There we go. All right, let's go to drop time real quick. And I guess what we'll do in this episode is probably escape. But I want to show you guys something before I actually do that. But I'll show you after drop time. So uh, be right to buck. Oh, oh shit! There's a guard up here. Hello. How's it going? Okay, so I noticed this only while well editing the last episode. And there's a vent over there. And there's a vent up here. So, I could probably just, you know, go and do that. Is there another guard going to come up here and see me fucking doing this shit? No, okay, they're going away. Okay, okay. I'm going to try this. I want to see if this actually lets me get back there. And that fence broke, so I got my other fence ready to go. I want to see if I can actually get to this sh shuttle over here. I'm not going to escape that way if we can get over there. Because I might as well at this point just do the other thing. Since it took forever to get the fucking batteries, dude. So, we got the fence. Yep, I knew there would be stuff here to cut. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. So I brought my cutters with me. That way we could use them. 
shit, what's next? I don't know what comes next. So, we'll go ahead and cut these things. There's three fences? Good god. What comes after job time? I forget. Free time. Free time is perfect. That is absolutely perfect for me. Come on, cut it a little bit faster, please. Oh my god. Yeah, that allows me to get over there. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? That's how you get to the shuttle then. Jesus Christ, so you don't need shovels or anything, shovels, pickaxes, or anything like that. You just need fucking cutters and screwdrivers. Which makes sense, because they don't give you any fucking timber at all. Let's get my... There we go. Ah! There we go. Let's unscrew this. Am I going to have enough energy to do this? I hope so. Oh my god, are you kidding me? No, fuck! That actually did end it. Well, ah, uh, maybe this one. Oh god, whoops. Nope, not that one. <laughs> oh, where is it? Please make an illegal U-turn. That'll do. I didn't get to read exactly what he said. Oh my god, I didn't want to break out that quickly. I thought I would have to go up and click on it. Oh well. I guess that was the space base. We're not done. We're not done, by the way. We're not done. I'm gonna go back in. I'm gonna go back in. So, I believe... If we just click continue, we can go right back to where we were. Correct? Yeah. Okay. I thought we would be able to. So, uh, put that fake vent away. Let's go ahead and... We're gonna cover this little spot back up. So, that's a way to escape. That's probably the easiest way to escape out of all of them. So, there was that. I noticed that while editing the last episode. I wanted to see if that was an actual way that I could escape. Because most of the time, things like that end up being something that you need multiplayer for. Or you need a second player, at least, to do them. So, I wanted to see, I wanted to see if that was actually doable. And it was. But whenever you beat a prison, you can continue the same game. And be right where you left off, basically, from the last save. So, I wanted to do that. Because... I got the batteries, it took me like, probably three to four hours just to get the batteries, which is insane. So I definitely, ooh, the jetpack doesn't say it's contraband, so I'm going to keep it in there like that. But I definitely wanted to do the jetpack route because it took forever to get to it, so why the fuck not do it, man? Why not? So let's go up to exercise time. I think I'm going to try it at night, and we'll see how it goes at night. I think there's, there's probably four different ways to actually escape this prison. One of them is the escape pods. I'm not sure if I actually ever mentioned that. I mentioned it in a video, but I don't know if I put it in. So just in case I didn't put it in, the escape pods are a multiplayer function, and they are over here above the cafeteria, basically. You just go up here, and then you're in here. There's a desk in here. The escape pods are over here on the right. You need someone to hold, these, to hold this door open so the other person can walk through. Probably press that button, which will open up the door, so that the other person can walk through. So that's how you use the escape pods, but I can't do that because I don't have another player with me at the moment. So, we got some of that. I'll just take this stuff to give to people. I don't want the stuff that's going to set up the contraband detector because I don't know where I'm going just yet. So, I have to get to the... Well, uh, lunchtime. I have to get... Yeah, I don't have any war... Uh, I don't have any contraband. So, we got to get to the warden's office, which means we got to go through where dogs are. So, the warden's office is over here on the left. It's right here, and there's apparently something in there. So, we can go there directly from our cell, but we gotta have a red key and a contraband bag to get through the contraband detector, and there's just dogs over there. So, I don't know if the dogs will start beating me up or anything like that. And I don't want to truly risk that just yet. So, let's go ahead, make some guards like us. Do you like me? You have a 69%. Let's go with 71. That's a bit better than it was before. So, I'm gonna probably wait till nighttime to do that attempt because I got two guards outfits. So I'll just throw in a guards outfit and then grab my other stuff. If we can get another red key though, that would be very good because this was at 60. I'm gonna use 40 of it just going in there. Correct? No, I'm only gonna use 20. Huh. Did I say I wasn't that? I was there. Don't give me that crap, I was there. So, uh, I'll take out that wire, just so we have a free spot in our 
desk inventory in case I need to maneuver things around. Uh, we don't really need this sheet metal. You know what I'm actually gonna do? Since I can, I'm just gonna craft that and put it back on. I think I switched keyboards. Nope, I didn't. Okay. Cool. So now we've got the high defense. So, could we literally just like walk back there or something? I don't know. Maybe we could, maybe we couldn't. It's hard to say. But I'm gonna use my good contraband pouch. I probably should have kept the duct tape, although contraband pouches, I got like a shite load of money. I've got, I've got the max money I can actually have. Huh, how about that? So, uh, let's grab this, we'll grab this. What else do we want? Okay, so is that everything that we need then? We got we got the red key, which will give us two uses. We can actually have six uses on it. We got a contra durable contraband pallet, so it's not going to break on us. We've got an energy sword, which is our best weapon that we can have at the moment. It's actually the only weapon we have other than the screwdriver, which is pretty pitiful, I gotta say. Um, you know what? Fuck. No! Give me the... Well, hang on a minute. I didn't know job time would come up next. I gotta make sure that I have a bed thing in my room before lights out. Lights out comes after a specific thing, but I don't remember what comes after, so I'm just gonna place the bed buddy in there. After job time here, I'm just gonna leave it there. I'm just gonna stand outside until it's time. All right, we've got the bed buddy. And the bed buddy is now in. So let's go ahead and grab the three things that I wanted. We'll actually grab a guard's outfit too. We'll put that in hiding. And that should be all we need to hide. So I'm not in the ring I'm not in the view of any uh, guards or anything like that. I don't know if the dogs will actually beat me up or not. I'm a little scared about that. I'm a little scared about that, that they'll just notice that I'm not an actual guard and just beat me up. So I'm gonna have to probably do it at nighttime. Although I wasn't yelled at when I was in the last restricted area. Maybe I can just do this. Maybe I can. Let's actually put that guard's outfit away. No, let's actually hide it. And let's just fucking do this. Let's just, let's just do this. If I go in here, and I just stand right here. Okay, so I need the jetpack with me. That's a lot of heat. That's a lot of heat. I'm gonna let that heat cool down a bit, so we need the jetpack with us. Okay, that makes a little bit more sense. Um... I wish I had a freaking medical thing. Really wish I did. So they, you do get heat for going back there, but only from the camera. From the seams. Ah, dinner time. Alright, I'll go to dinner time real quick. I'm not giving up on this. We will do this. Okay, so it's free time. I'm just gonna go for it. Because why the fuck not? I've got my heat down. So, camera sees me. Fantastic. I can do this now. We got the jetpack on. Don't press that. <laughs> oh my god, he's floating. Air, help! Call admin! Oh my god. <laughs> wow. I just float out. I'm just floating past all the guards to a random location that has another shuttle. Okay, I don't know where this is. Fly! Do I know how to fly? Okay then! Race for rum space. Holy shit. So there you go, that's two ways of escaping the prison. I don't know if there's any other ways of escaping the prison that I can do on my own. But there you go, we have escaped the space base. We have escaped the space base, everybody. So, the only prison that I haven't done is this one, which I got for, for pre-ordering the game. And the Tundra one, which I just 
I just haven't played it. So, I think I'm actually... I think we're actually going to be ending the series here. I, I think we're played out pretty well on The Escapist 2. We've seen a lot. We've seen almost everything there is to it. But, there we go. I did show a lot of... Like, every... Every prison, if we go back here, if we go to criminal record, every prison has multiple ways of escaping. So there's tons of things you can do. Some of them you can only do by yourself, and some of them you can only do with other people. Like, Rouse Snake Springs has two things that you can do by yourself, and then one that you need to do with someone else. I don't know about all the rest, but there, I think every prison has at least two things that you can do, two ways of escaping that you could do by yourself, to some extreme. Now, how you get them and whatnot is unknown. Is it, oh, hey, you get rewards. Oh my god, can I have a reward? For beating Area 17, I can put a mask on myself? I want to see that real quick. I want to see that real quick. If we go to... Good god, I've got so much of them. Let's go to hats. We've got all these different things. We go to beards. No, we go to facial things. There we go, we can just put ourselves a mask. Oh my god, that's awesome. There we go. We're now an alien. We're ending the series as an alien. But anyway, that was The Escapist 2. I will most likely be leaving the series here. I don't really plan on returning to it unless you guys want to see more. If you guys want to see more, let me know. I don't know if there's a community thing. I know in The Escapist 1, you people can make their own prisons. I'm pretty sure that's how it worked at least. So, I don't know if that's a feature in this one yet because this is still kind of newer to an extreme. Like, they might still be updating the game, they might be still like fixing bugs, preparing more content, more prisons to come out, I'm not really sure. I don't really know too much on it. I try to stay away from like knowing too much about games that I'm doing or that I plan on doing. Simply because I like to be either surprised or be taken by surprise by things that I didn't know about the game before. So, anyway, like I said, I will be leaving this here, this one here, as well as probably the series here, unless you guys want to see more. Like I said before, if you do and want to see more of this game, let me know. But anyway, I will be leaving this one here. So, until whatever comes next, everybody, bye!